So there's been, Larry, I don't know why this hasn't been put to bed yet, but I thought me and you put it to bed a long time ago. All right. <laughs> Ghost is dead, ladies and gentlemen. Amari Harwick has said it five different times from Sunday that Ghost is dead, and here he is saying it again. To all of my dear fans, you guys live with us for six seasons. I want to say thank you for embracing me as your ghost, specifically in this journey and all of the parts of that guy. There were three people in one. I want to say there were never any fans like you. I had done this TV thing prior, and I don't know if I knew what a real fan was until I was on a show called Power. Your ghost is in Power Heaven. Your Omari is, in fact, right here. I want to say I love you. Peace. Ghost He's isn't dead. dead. Ghost He's isn't dead. dead. He's just not. He's just not ghost anymore. Okay, so Tariq is ghost then. Tariq but, is a new ghost. So here's the problem. And, and Tariq you, is part of his father. So 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 ghost lives on. How about that, people? There you go. Now you have now you have your ghost. We've been said that ghost persona is Tariq, <laughs> but what people are clamoring for, Larry, is Amari Hartwick. They don't they don't care about. They want ghost in Amari Hartwick and Larry. Put it to bed. He's not coming I mean, back. Is he? He's not coming I mean, back. Here's the thing. This this is a, this is the thing, right? Right. What's her name? Courtney Kemp has given us a fantastic show. With a, and it's a really a testament to her writing and the writing of all the of their entire writing staff. They have given us a show that is absolutely fantastic from a character that I think we all universally hated. I mean, yeah, none of us, I don't think we anybody that, that on this show, I don't think anybody that came and watched and commented, I don't think anybody <laughs> liked Tariq. I think I think it was universal that we all hated Tariq. Hate him. And, Hate and them. somehow <laughs> they have given us a show that we, based on him, that we actually really like. That's a good show. It's in, it's entertaining. It's engaging. It's fun to watch. You know, he inspires us to get out and get in shape because as much as he's running track the, through the halls of his college, I mean, <laughs> the dude better not be wearing any classic Air Force Ones because he's just chewing them up. But in all seriousness, it's a great show. It's a lot of fun. And and when I say great, I mean great in the sense that it's entertaining. I'm not saying it's it's the highest form of art. It's it's entertaining. I get that. And so I mean now, now that's why I gotta stop you now. Let me tell you about a part of the show that is just pure trash ass writing. The part where they got my girl, Professor Carey. Just getting moist when she hear locks and keys. That's horrible writing. <laughs> Take that out. The show would be a whole lot better. I'm tired of them doing her like that. It makes Ooh. no damn sense that that professor of education cannot be left alone in a room with somebody if she hear doors and locks opening. I'm to take that out and I'll be with the show. Now, if you th if you think that's bad, just imagine on the second half of this season how upset you're going to be when we see Tariq smack those cheeks with the doors open. Man, stop it, man. He's going to clap those cheeks. Man. Clap, 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 no, clap, man. Clap, clap, no, the doors Larry, no, wide no, open. No, no. no Tariq <laughs> will not be getting <laughs> Professor Carey's panty draws. Forget it. Just forget it. Forget it. So All up in them. Go ghost is still alive, but uh, Mari Hartwick's ghost is dead. And now we'll move on to now, now. Here's this though, I I I I expect this, and I don't know how Amari Hardwick feels about this, mm -hmm. and I don't know what his contract looks looks like, but I could see Ghost coming back. I can see Amari Hardwick. I can see I can see uh, uh, James St. Patrick coming back. Oh, as oh. as an actual ghost. Very much the way that they brought Angela back damn near for a whole season as a ghost in his, you know, in his in his mind, in his realm. I could very much see them bringing him back as a ghost, you know, maybe in Tommy's show, you know, mm. maybe Tommy has these experiences of what would ghosts do, you know, 
Right. And maybe I, maybe I could see him bringing it back towards the end if Tariq really starts to get in trouble at the end of this season. But I don't think so. I think if they brought him back for Tariq's show, it would have to be next year because they want to establish Tariq as his own man. They can't do that if his dad's popping up. So, But I think maybe – I can see them bringing him back as a ghost, a real ghost. You know, now see, I'm with I'm with my my homegirl Tressa. I just don't see that, and I think it would be crazy at this point. I think if they was gonna have ghosts as a ghost, they would have done it by now. And to bring and for Courtney and them to try to bring him back in some small capacity without actually using him fully, I think that would just be a recipe for disaster. Like, the, you've got to go ahead and turn that corner and let him be, Larry. I don't think they need to even tease people like that. And, look, Ooh, you, done got, you done got people started in there talking about Professor Carey. People down there clicking locks and clicking keys. I didn't that, bring that, 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 you that brought move, that Chella, up. Move, Chella. <laughs> you, you, stop it, move, Chella. Stop it. <laughs> now, how about this? Let's say, let's say that Tasha – in prison, hooks up with some with some hoodoo or voodoo chick and teaches no. her how to get that juju going, and she brings ghosts back. No, she conjures them no. back up. No, no, man, this ain't Lovecraft power. <laughs> no, <laughs> Lovecraft ghosts. No, man, forget it, forget it. How about this Powercraft country? <laughs> man, no, you see this. You you you've been begging for a crossover show. You want to see. Power book to mix with a little bit of the um the shy, mix with a little bit of snowfall, mix with a little bit of um what's the other show on um stars that we watch? Um Cape Town, mix with a little bit of that, and then you want to go throw in some Lovecraft Country on top of all that for like an all-star you know? TV show. Man, we're done with we're done with this. Omari Harbor is not coming right. back. Unless Before it's a go, new season. I have, to, I have to take issue with somebody in the comments. They might need to get blocked. What's that? I don't who know is? who this Keo DeGoat is, but you about to be on my bad side, man. Hey, I don't I'm, know who you are. I don't know what you're about, but you talking about you hate Ramona? Come on, son. <laughs> don't That's get right. blocked up in this piece. Hey, don't get Ke blocked up Ke in here. Keo DeGoat. <laughs> He has no authority to block you on my live stream. This is not his live stream. And if you want to talk about Ra away. if you I'll want to talk away. about if you want to talk about Ramona slip and slide forehead, talk about that forehead all you want to. I see foreheads like that at pool sides. Talk about her all you want to. And, and who is see like now you got other people in here putting up keys. He's mad because. He's mad because I picked the beautiful, self, you know, self-aware, intelligent woman what? with some integrity who only what? gives it up when she really is into somebody. And he didn't pick the the educated hooker, the the one that's just letting everybody clap their cheeks. She man, just, you know, Larry, she has <laughs> a problem that she's getting help with. Uh, everybody has a problem, problem, right? Everybody has an issue. Like, nobody's perfect. Not even I'm a Ramona. Download, I'm gonna download a door lock sound effect on my uh, phone. I'm gonna go find her and it. just play. It. That's click, it. click. That, that's it. Sudden, we're, we're done. We're no more. <laughs> that is the end of power, ladies and gentlemen. We're moving on. 